Welcome to Limahuli Gardens. This land division or Ahupua'a is one of the most biodiverse valleys in all of Hawaii. Humans have inhabited and cared for this valley for over a thousand years. It is home to many of our native plants and animals, like the native a'o, moths, o'opu, lawa'e ferns, papala trees, and so much more. These species are able to thrive in this valley today because of a land management system practiced by the ancient Hawaiians. The land management system is called the Ahupua'a, which refers to a watershed or a land management system from Mauka to Makai. Some people think of the Ahupua'a system as something of the past, but here in Limohuli, it is still very alive and well today. In recent years, Kauai has experienced increasing extreme weather events, leading to natural disasters like landslides. Here at Limohuli, we are looking to our ancestors for better ways of managing and preventing floods and runoff from negatively affecting our ahupua'a system. Runoff occurs when there's too much water for the land to absorb. Instead, the water flows over the earth's surfaces, ending up in streams, ponds, and eventually in the ocean. As the water flows over the earth's surface, it naturally erodes the soil. During an extreme weather event, powerful stormwater runoff can displace large amounts of land all at once. Runoff is a major source of water pollution. Along with soil, runoff picks up and deposits pollutants into waterways. These pollutants can include fertilizers, pesticides from farmlands, gasoline from our roadways, litter, sewage, and much more. Once this toxic runoff enters our streams and oceans, animals absorb and consume the toxins, negatively impacting the food chain. But there's good news. Native habitat acts like a sponge, absorbing and filtering many harmful chemicals before they end up in our stream and waterways. A thriving ecosystem with plants, animals, and humans working together is essential in preventing and lessening the damage of storm water runoff. Here are some of the things that Limohuli staff have done to protect this watershed. Here at Limohuli, we use a variety of native plants to mitigate future erosion, like native ferns to hold the soil intact, or native sedges like ahuava and trees and shrubs like mamaki. Now it's time for you to take care of your aina. What are things that you can do to protect your ahupua'a where you live, go to school, and play? Ahui ho, and until next time, don't forget to malama your aina.